Welcome to this screencast on the NSI Auto Store front panel simulator for Kyocera. In today's screencast, I'm going to give you a quick overview of configuring and sharing demos. So after downloading the front panel simulator, the first step to accessing all the features is to register. Once registered, you'll gain access to the What You See is What You Get style editor to quickly and easily configure demos, uh, the virtual business card where you can insert your personal contact information, um, access to the resources section where you can download product resources, plus you'll be able to save and export custom demos for sharing with a prospect. My demo app is already registered, so let's create a custom demo in the demos menu. This takes you to the playlist where you can save, edit, rename and export demos. So I'm like to create a new demo to configure for my prospect at Acme Company. So I clicked on create new demo and I'm going to name it something specific to them. And when I scroll over the playlists, you'll see that there's these action buttons to the right with tooltips that tell you what each of them does. So I want to configure this to make it a little bit more personal to Acme. And I'll click on Configure Demo to bring up the editor. Anything that's bound in a yellow box can be edited, like text and images. And that's true throughout the entire simulator. So you can um, scroll or click on screens to the left here to configure buttons and fields and images. But I think what we're going to do is keep it simple and just customize the welcome screen. So to ed make an edit to one of these boxes, you just have to click on it and start making changes. Um, when you click on an image, it'll bring up the asset library where you can choose from preloaded images already in the simulator, or you can add your own down here at Add New Images. I've already added the Acme Company logo, so I'm just going to select that and add it to the welcome page. Now another thing I'd like to do is add a virtual business card with my contact information uh, that'll show up at the end of each demo. So I'll go ahead and edit this field. Now in order for this to show up in the configured demo that we're going to share, this needs to be selected. It says show virtual business card in this little tick box. So now that it's selected, we can go ahead and save and exit the editor. So now that we have a customized uh, demo for Acme Company, we want to share it with them, which we'll do back at the playlist and under Demos. Scroll over our customized demo, and there's a couple options here in these action buttons. First, we could publish this demo, which means that we're going to publish it to the internet, and they're going to be able to um, access the demo through a URL that you can share. That way it's uh, easier for you to share that with them. You don't have to worry about file sizes and email or anything like that. So that's through publishing. Or if you prefer a file, you can export the demo. And what that's going to do, we'll just click uh, the desktop. What that's going to do is give you a nice little file on your desktop that you can go ahead and zip up and send to an email address or put onto a USB for sharing with your customized demo. So this concludes our brief screencast on the NSI Auto Store front panel simulator for Kyocera.